はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。はい。Getting lucky in the morning, but we got two days to hunt, and, it, and it's supposed to rain tomorrow. So we're gonna go out midday and see what we can get done. See if we can't get it done. There's deer right there. Oh, there's deer. Show them. Right, show them. Okay, so we got deer in the yard. But we're just gonna walk over. In the neck. Oh, I got nervous. <laughs> it's okay. Hey, hey. I don't know. We don't know. We're gonna be. We're gonna be alright. But right before I shot, I twitched. She just laid down over there. Right. Look at me. Right before I shot. Yeah. I was sitting right because she was moving. I saw that. And I twitched right. Really. I twitched right there. It probably wasn't the best. Um. Well, I have all those, these branches. All these branches are here. I know, she was just quartering away a little bit too much. Sit back down. I see you. Now it's a waiting game. You took a shot, so. She walks out in here to have a good shot. I don't because I got limbs in front of me, you know, so I couldn't shoot her, and she looked right at me as I was standing up, I was like, uh-oh, but then she just put her head back down, so I drew, and 
she turned around and started walking that way and she was cording away pretty bad should I have taken the shot dude I don't know but I was there was so much happening I didn't know I, I was so there was oh my gosh it was pretty crazy I made a really bad shot it why did I make sense. a really bad shot because right as I was about to pull the trigger I just like twitched yeah I did not take any deep breaths before I shot it's the first deer I've ever shot first bow shot at Com- with a compound and I freaked out and I hopefully, hopefully <coughs> we still put the deer down um, we're gonna there's, see there's no footage to show you guys what happened no we got footage cause Braden put the camera at the deer's feet no listen we got cause I thought he was gonna hit it in the heart I didn't think he was gonna <laughs> shoot the thing in the neck <laughs> and uh, I shot it in the neck but it, du- it was high shoulder and then it ducked it did duck so that's why it's his fault it's her fault that it went in her neck but anyway the, that she that ran was a, that was a me, crap show let me hit you with this okay Ben shot it was a rough shot. Yes. She ducked. Yes. Ran about 10 yards. Was zigzagging. Was kind of freaking out a little bit. We don't know if the arrow went all the way through. I think it popped out at some point. She stayed. I saw her run about 50 yards out. And just like stand right there. Like kind of in like a half crouch. I don't have eyes on her now. She could have went down. We don't know. We're going to take it year by year, play by play, year by year, yeah. and see what happens here. But we're in for, we're in for something. And we'll, we got a day ahead of us, and it's going to be interesting. So we're going to see what happens here and, and kind of go from there. <coughs> we'll keep you updated. All right, so we're and back. And so it begins. We came back to the house, let that deer sit for about an hour, maybe a little over an hour. We called. We called Braden's dad. We called our good friend Colt Money. Colt Money. He's part of FNF. He's he knows. y'all know him. Y'all know him. He called he Colt Money. He knows. And he said that. Um, what did he say? Windpipe. If it hits the windpipe, that thing's gonna drop. We're looking for the, arteries or windpipe. I don't know. We're gonna see. I mean, it it, it went all the way through. Yeah. We, good we're viewing on the fit on the footage where it hit. It should not have lived. Was it a good shot? No, it was an awful shot. But I think I got lucky that. It hit the neck, not anywhere else. But. Yeah, we're gonna go follow the blood trail, see what we can do, see if we can recover it. Pray, pray, to make sure we can. So we're gonna see what's up. Yeah, we'll let you know. We'll let you know. Good blood here, dude. If this deer isn't dead, this is a super deer. Cause I've, ne- I mean, this is a retarded amount of blood. Good blood. Good blood. Wow. You got blood over here? Blood there. Yep. Blood here. You got blood here. Oh, Here's blood. A lot of blood. On that rock. The question is where did she go out to the rock? On this rock. On which one? This rock. We got blood here. All right. Got blood on this leaf. What leaf? Yeah, right here. She's still coming this way. She's getting nervous. Real we got a lot of blood though, dude. Where did she go from here? Where you got blood, yep. Good blood, pools of blood. Right here. Yep. A lot of blood. What is this thing? More blood, more blood. Probably she's still going, dude. This is crazy. Gotta be down here somewhere. We gotta kind of inch. Here's more blood. And now, where do we go? Here's more blood. Here's a good bit of blood. That's really nice blood. Good blood. Oh, oh my God, dude! She came up here, Ben. Stay right here, let me knock on these people's door. 
Got more blood over there. She's gonna be right on this dude's back porch. I don't think anybody's home. She's dead. I can't believe she's still going, dude. Right, we need blood, Ben. Where? Gonna do about it? We're gonna do about it. Nothing. We live in and we learn, we get over it. We're headed out now. Evening hunt, evening sit. Place that there's been big bucks in there continuously for the past few days. I got my eye on a few. We're gonna see what happens. You know, if a big one comes in, I'm probably taking a gun. Crossbow. If a nice one comes in, Ben will probably shoot it. If a doe comes in, Ben's gonna smoke it. We'll oh, turn around, damn it. Yeah, we hunted this morning. We no, got no, out we there on them. We didn't see a deer. Uh, we're hoping in this rain if they start moving a little bit. Braden's theory is they do move in the rain. It's just they wait to see if it's going to stop raining before they move. That's his theory. So they, they do move in the rain. They don't like to. But once they got to move, they got to move. So they're going to start moving. It's about, it's about 11.30. So... Midday, we're gonna get on a little midday hunt because today's the last day we can go. But wish us luck. Would you just wish us luck? Midday sent back. Cause we need some love. The series of events that we've been through, man. It's not good. We need a little we, bit of that thing. We've, we we've been luck. through a lot. We've been through a lot. We've been through not a lot, but hell. Mm. We mm. might have been through it all. Mm. We'll see what we'll see what we can get into. Look, can we take a moment? I look good. And look at this poncho, dude. It's called the Frogman outfit. The Frogman. The Frogman outfit. Froggy Frogman. And why you look like that? I'm going to kill him. So. <laughs> Tell them about it. This is stupid. Cause there ain't no deer. There ain't no deer. Cranky this job. What's going on here today? Oh. Uh, on this afternoon. Last hunt. Uh -oh. This is our last chance. That's Pocono it. Mountains 2023. Man. We've we've had one opportunity to kill a deer, but other than that, we haven't seen a single deer. So we're hoping that uh, you know we've been going through it. We're hoping that we get a little reward here mm -hmm. this last last afternoon hunt. Mm -hmm. uh, it's been it's been it's been rough times in the deer woods. And hard but times for the deer, man. Hard times for the deer, man. So we're we're hoping. Hail Mary. And I'm hopeful. I'm Be hopeful. hopeful. I'm and be hopeful. I'm, I'm hopeful. Like I was saying, the last hunt, it always gets me. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's sad. I don't know if it's like pressure. But that last hunt that you have for the 
time you have is tough. I don't know how I'm feeling right now. I'm feeling queasy. I can know. Here's what's happening, right? We've got a lower, a middle, and an upper food plot. Throughout the years, they've been more in the middle food plot. I've always seen deer there. That's where I shot my first deer. You know, it's, it's a good stand and it's a good spot. And for the last hunt, I think we got to go there. I think that's going to be our best shot. So we're parked right under it right now. We're going to walk up here soon. You know, the way it, it's got a circle and then it goes up a little hill and then it kind of, you know, it's on an angle. So hopefully they're going to come from either behind us or below us. You know, we can get a shot on a nice one. But it's raining right now, as you can see. Not ideal conditions for deer movement. But nobody ever said the deer don't move in the rain. Nobody ever said that. Conditions are at the worst that they've been all day. I'm cold. I'm wet. We're going through it. Yeah. I just had a nice little spike walk by. Nice spot, deer. And we were going to let her go. I was tempted. But we keep using self-control in that way. Put, put oh, I mean, come on, man. We just been in the tree stand for three hours <laughs> in the rain. We really gonna worry about this? Yeah. Look. Look. Let me tell them what happened. Look, I'm gonna tell them what happened. You tell. What you don't know. I know what happened. We uh, didn't kill nothing. We didn't. Uh, it, it was a rough day. A hard really, time for really, day, really rough day. Um, I'm gonna just pull a quote from you. Can I pull a quote from you? Pull one. This, Britton said. This is one of the harder days I've had in the deer woods. And that, and if that ain't a fact. And why? Why is it? Can you explain? 40 degrees with rain is about terrible. Because it's like, it's, and it's not it's not a little trickle. It's not a little pee pee. It's a damn, I mean, you wake up in the morning stream. You know what I'm talking about? It's one of them rains. So that ain't good. You get cold, you get wet. Deer aren't moving as much. So one little spike today, that was about it. That's it. it fly. Yeah, it was it was tough. Overall, it's been a tough weekend. Tough weekend. Um, you know, I blew it on that doe. Yeah, you did. And we really didn't see much else other than that. So that was our opportunity and I blew it. So you well, know, that's deer hunting. That is deer hunting. That's hunting in general. You know, they, that's no. what I call it, hunting and not killing. Isn't that's that hunting. what they say? Well, they call it hunting. Not fishing and not catching. No, well, they call that, it hunting. It, and it works. Well, it works for hunting, too. But, uh, boy. Mm. It was a rough one. We you gonna, know? We're going to get her back, though, one of these days. One of these days, we'll be back at the Pocono Mountains filming stay. another video, and we're going to show you a dead deer. We're going to stay on them. So, hope you guys have a good one. Because we're not. What you gonna do? Ain't nothing you do. Now this is messed up. Look at this. Somebody take a look at this. What was happening here is, we were out in the stand in the elements all day yesterday and saw one spike. We've been looking all weekend for a nice little dove like that. She ain't gonna be over there. On the land? No. Come be right here. On this dang on now. Now granted, do they got a pair too? Some old pairs that we left in the fridge? Maybe. Okay. But it's it's hard times. We're going through it right now. This is I don't even know what to do now. Get out of here. I'm about to get the crossbow. I'm gonna get it. 